Today is a serious topic about how we promote freedom using Twitter. I've recently seen some less than nice tweets about leech networks and scams and spam. And guys, when you promote freedom or when others talk about freedom, there is a fine line between criticizing a network because you have personal bad experience or your friend does and just saying emotional things that really don't make sense and put a bad image on yourself and on the network that you are trying to promote. Guys, when you are criticizing a network, use specific examples. Say things like, I was not paid for the month of X and I'm really upset. That's a criticism. Or, I don't like the dashboard of Network Y because it doesn't help me grow and here's why. Don't create general statements like, Network X is a scam because it's a scam. That's not a criticism. That's just an emotional outburst. And all that does is it creates bad feelings because obviously no one likes to be called a scam. And if you don't support your claim, then other people reading you will think, well, who is this silly person who's just blasting things out that don't make any sense? Use clear reasons and have an argument with facts, not fiction, or opinions, or testimonials. Of course, some opinions aren't facts, they're just your opinion. I like blue. <laughs> That's an opinion. But try not to use these overarching terms that really just get people emotional and nothing else. I mean, it might make you feel good to let off some steam, but that's all that's going to be the positive, and all the negative is bad impressions. So tell me in the comments below how you promote freedom or how you've seen freedom being promoted by others. I would love to see what the community is doing, what features you feel are really cool, and let's keep this clean. Let's keep all of our tweets and all of our posts and all of our messaging on Skype. Just friendly competition, clean competition, and don't say emotional things. I hope this helps, guys, and I'm trying to make sure everyone understands that we would never endorse something where people use strong emotional language because that's not how we would want us to be talked about. And so we do unto others as we would want done unto us. Does that make sense? All right, tell me in the comments below. I read everything. I can't reply to everything, but I really do enjoy reading your comments, and I reply to those that I can reply to. Take care, guys. My name is George, founder of Freedom, and you've been watching The George Show, unedited.